There are traces of war all around the village of Peromaisk in eastern Ukraine's Donetsk region. More than 2,000 people lived here before hostilities began about two years ago. Now the village has only a few hundred residents. Many came from other towns and took over abandoned houses. Valentin and his wife came from nearby Piski, which was almost completely destroyed by heavy artillery fire. He says, I lived in the basement for three months, and then, when the winter came, it was necessary to look for somewhere to spend the winter. No one is asking here for permission. Those who stayed in Pervomaisk and neighboring villages live in relatively well-maintained houses. They still hear sounds of gunfire, but the village is no longer being shelled. Valentin and his wife, Lubov, moved into a house that was livable but still needed work. She says, you see, they repaired the house and they threw everything out and left. So we dragged some of the furniture from our home. Our neighbor gave us some carpets, which we unrolled here. The couple is retired. Their pension is their only income. But even if they wanted work, there's none here anyway. Lubov says, we use my pension to buy bread, sugar and maybe some goodies. We send his miners' pension to the town of Lutsk because our daughter lives there with our two grandchildren in a hotel. The couple started farming at their new home. Despite the difficulties and fear they live with, they plan to stay in the region. When warm weather returns, they want to return to Piski to restore their house. They hope one day peace will return there too.